welcome back to my channel. I'm working on my room at the moment so we're kind of like just on a blank canvas because the rest of the room around me is basically like a bomb site. Um, but it's finally coming together and I've got like a makeup station for when I'm filming my makeup videos and I've also got like a little fashion section here for when I'm filming fashion stuff. So it's all going to work out really well. Hopefully I'll be able to film more and be more organised. But I just wanted to jump right in with my Boohoo haul. I actually just ordered some swimwear while I was on holiday there <laughs> um, for when I go back in September. I didn't really need any, but actually the first item that's in here was the reason why I went onto the website in the first place and discovered they had a sale on. I seen this little green top um, on Emily Shack on Instagram while I was on holiday and I just obviously went straight over so I'll actually get started with this one. Um, I think it came in at £9. It's so cute. It looked amazing on her. I have already tried this on and unfortunately like, it's a little bit disappointing for me personally and my like body shape and stuff but you'll see when I do the try on clip. So basically that was the first item that I'm going to show you and it's the only item that's in this bag that's not swimwear. So this top is the reason that I actually clicked on to Boohoo in the first place. I don't know if I said in the last clip that I seen this on Emily Shack's Instagram while I was on holiday and I just like clicked through to see this top. It was only £9 which is why I picked it up and then noticed that they had a sale on their bikinis and ended up ordering so many bikinis. Um, I wouldn't wear it with these shorts, I just put it on with these shorts to show you. I really like the colour of this top, it's so cute but it's way like shorter than what I thought it would be. I would re really need like really high waisted to get away with wearing it and also it's like very like flimsy so as you can see here it's like turning down. I've put a bra on with it because see when I didn't have a bra on it just like fell. <laughs> My boobs were far too heavy for it. I think this would be much better on someone that's just got less of a chest. Um, you can see like it's just curling down. I think it would annoy me all night. Like I'll be like hooking it up constantly. So unfortunately I think that this top is also going back. So the next item that I ordered is actually a bikini. So this is the pants. I'm actually not sure how well these are showing up on camera. When I look in the viewfinder they're kind of like a limey sort of yellow. But they're actually like bright neon green slash yellow. If I bring them in closer maybe... Yeah, they're definitely not showing up as luminous on camera as what they are. So these are mix and match bikinis. So I bought the pants and the top separate. And this is actually their petite range, which I didn't realise when I ordered. I ordered the bottoms in a size 10. If you watch my videos regularly, you'll probably know that I'm about a size 8, 6 in dresses. Um, when it comes to bikinis or anything on the bum, I definitely need a size 10 just because I've got a little bit of a bigger bum than the norm, I guess. So the pants were on sale at £4, £4.50 sorry, and the top is just like a little bandeau style. I actually can't believe the difference in colour, this is shown up on the viewfinder. Um, it's really, really vibrant in real life. I'll try and insert a picture actually after this. This is also a size 10. Um, and it's got the attachable straps obviously each side and it can just be a halter neck. So I'll show you this in the try on clip also. This came in at £4 so in total this bikini was £8.50 which is it's like such a good price for a bikini obviously and I was looking for a neon bikini for a really long time. One that I could actually tan in because for some reason this year they're all Instagram bikinis for photographs. They're definitely not for sunbathing that's for sure because I don't want all those silly lines. So this one I'm pretty set on keeping. This is a top. I wish I could turn up the vibrancy somehow to let you see how nice this neon colour is. So it is, it comes straight and you twist it to put it on. Um, and then these are detachable so you can literally just take that off. Uh, it just clips at the back. It is a size 10. It fits actually really, really well. I, I'm a 32D if that helps anybody in bust size. And I'm getting away with a size 10 in this. This is the pants. I'm only going to show you to there. <laughs> um, so they are that high rise. They do sit at quite a nice place. And it is not really a cheeky bikini or a thong. It's a pretty full brief. 
Um, I really do like this, it's super cute and the price at £9.50 was so good and I'm actually just so glad I finally found a neon green yellow bikini because I was looking for one for ages and as I said they were all like funky shades. The next bikini I got is this adorable, it's like a tangerine kind of orangey colour, this is showing up true to life actually on camera, um, it fastens at the front. So it fastens at the front, just here, um, it's, it's so cute on, it's so so nice. This came in at a size 10, um, I really like this, I was surprised I liked this actually, I wasn't expecting to like it, I just order things and I'm like oh I'll try it anyway. So this was only £10 as well and the pants are so nice also, they've got a really nice like gold buckle detail on each side, almost full but it's high leg. So next we have this tangerine one, it fastens at the front, it is like tiny on the cups, let me like come in closer. I think obviously it is meant, I think this is the style of it but I just feel like I'm bulging out like far too much here. I, it is a size 10, I could definitely do with a size 12, there's just really eh, not enough cup for me and it is pulling a little bit on the back but I love the shape, I love the colour, I really really like this and I really want to keep it. Again the bottoms are that um, high leg and they are pinching a little bit on my sides. Again it's just my shape, I do have a little bit extra weight on but definitely more my shape than my weight and it is like full on the back so that's the side obviously and I just, I don't actually know if I've got the confidence to wear something as naked as this on holiday and I also think my sister would be mortified. Maybe if I was going away with um, like some other girl pals that were wearing like more cheeky bikinis but yeah I've gone with my sister so I don't think she would appreciate it but anyway this one is really really cute I love it but I just think it pinches all so the next one was actually my favourite one that I ordered obviously until it came so this is how it looks again it is, it is bright neon green I do not know why it's showing up a different colour so it's got obviously the buckle detail on each strap and a buckle detail at the bottom. Obviously you're going to be able to see this better when I try it on. And they have matching bottoms which are definitely uh, a cheeky bikini. So it is the same. It's got this matching kind of buckle detail here. Um, I got this in a size 10. Both of these are a size 10. It came as a set and the price was £13.50. I don't think I'm going to be able to show you this fully on camera because it's, um, I don't really want to get almost naked on camera to be honest. So I am going to show you this on but I'll probably like put on shorts or something just so you can see. So I'm going to show you the picture on the model just so that you can get a better idea of how it looked. So this is how it looked on the model so you can obviously see like it's a little bit more risky for me to show you fully. But you can see properly like the buckle detail and stuff. Really I've got to try on for you is this one which obviously I've already spoke about. I completely love the top. I love this buckle detail that we've got here. It just adds that something extra to this bikini and I obviously like the fact that they've added it here as well. Um, you can wear this bikini up a little bit so you've got that little bit of cheeky under boob as well. Um, it's just that straight across at the back. You have to pull it on over your head. Love, love, love the top but it came as a set and I don't like the bottoms so I definitely can't keep it. I've got my shorts on with this because I don't want to show it on camera. Completely uncomfortable in this um, bikini bottom so I definitely would be uncomfortable on the beach. It's got the little buckle detail here which is cute as well. It digs in just a little bit too much here. Definitely doesn't suit my body shape whatsoever. It comes up far too much at the back. The pants are actually baggy at the back. They come right the way in and show off your full bum. So it is more like a thong bikini but then for some reason there's far too much material here. So basically like I've got a covered back. I don't know, I don't think they're meant to sit away up there anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah, such a shame this game is a set because I could have kept the top more with other bottoms because of the exact same colour. But unfortunately, that is a set so it is going back. So next we have this one which is came in £16.20 and it is a size 10. It's so, whoop, wrong way around. It's so cute. So that's the bottoms which obviously there isn't much to show you. There's just like a little like buckle detail on each side um, of the bottoms. But the top is literally like adorable look. It's got nice full cups. It's got really good support and stuff in it. Um, the colours are absolutely beautiful. Like it's shown up to life. It's gorgeous. 
Um, my only thing is, is that when I did order this, I, I just threw it in because I wanted the other things anyway and I thought I'll try it on. It's very similar to a lot of the bikinis that I've got, so this is probably one that I would definitely think more about sending back purely because I already have other bikinis like this, even though I probably like the top of this the best out of all of them. And also it's white and white just gets like completely ruined, especially with me, I don't know, maybe I'm rough on my bikinis or something, but um, sit in the sand too much or that, but they just get like really, really ruined. So as I said, I think this one's probably my favorite um, of the bundle, but I, I am sending it back. It was £16.40 or something like that. Um, for me, I can't justify keeping it when it looks too similar to bikinis that I already have. I literally love the shape of this. Like, it gives me such a nice shape, like, with, like, kind of my body shape. Again, the pants are straight across. I think you'll agree to do suit me. There's the little gold um, circles here. Rings, which are really nice. It is a full brief. It fits like a glove. Like, the fit on this bikini is, like, so nice. Um, it just ties at the back, ties at the neck. Quite simple. I'm going to bring in, show you closer up the pattern. It is such a cute um, bikini top. Boo, I've put this thing on it. This is the only bikini that came with these tags. I don't know if this is a new thing they're doing, obviously, uh, to stop people wearing things and sending them back. Don't know if they mind if we do videos for them and send them back, but anyway. So, this is this bikini. It is super cute. I wish I didn't have a hundred other bikinis like it, or I would definitely be keeping this. Also, maybe if I didn't think I was going to get this white And mood. lastly is this one, which has actually arrived and was really disappointing. Um, and I'm now actually so surprised it was £16. <laughs> uh, so this is it here. There's not really much to it. It's not the kind of green colour that I thought it would be. Again, on camera, it's not showing up. This is like a dirty green. Um, not neon at all. It really does look a bit dusky, a bit dull. These little white plastic rings here look so cheap. Like, I don't like them at all. I didn't even realise it was £16, honestly. Um, I bought a size 8. They must have only had a size 8 in stock. This is the cups. Obviously, they are super tiny. Again, this silly plastic ring that looks dead cheap. There's no padding in the triangle. Like, I don't know about you, but I always need a bit of padding in my bikinis. I will not go out without something, like, covering a wee bit. Like, there, it's completely... I would, yeah, it's got to be see-through on the beach. Literally get that wet and it'll be see-through. This is a definite 100% no. Next we have this one, which I did mention was my least favourite of the bundle. The plastic rings, as you can see. It is a funky colour. It's see-through. I hope that's not shown up on camera. Um, it is like a nice fit in the bottoms, to be fair. The bum is okay as well. Full brief, considering it's a size smaller than the rest of them. It fits fine. It is a lower rise bikini, which I think you might all agree that suits me better than the higher rise. Um, yeah, I won't talk too much about this. It was £16, a little bit too expensive for what it is, in my opinion. And that pretty much brings us to the end of this video. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you again soon. Mwah. Bye.